beautiful game has provided us with some of the most iconic goals in history. And today, I'm going to attempt to recreate them by scoring one iconic goal from every year going all the way back to 2000. And the year 2000 blessed us with many good goals, but there was one standout goal, Thierry Henry's volley versus Man United. So we're going to attempt to recreate it. But there was one thing I forgot to mention, which is I'm only going to have five attempts to recreate each iconic goal. Every time I fail, I get one fail point. And the more fail points I get, the worse the forfeits will get throughout this video. With that said, let's get on to the first goal and recreate Thierry Henry's volley versus Man United. Here it is. Flicks it up. Volleys it. Oh, it's gone in. That's a great first attempt, but we're going to give it another go. We're going to smash this. We're going to make this one better. But our second attempt would fail miserably. And we would come closer with our third go. No! That went top bins. That's it. We've done it. But our fourth was the closest yet. Flick up. Volley. Oh, my God. That was it. That was absolutely it. And on our last attempt, we smashed it in. Volley. That's it. That's it. I'm taking that. Moving on to 2001, we have one of the most iconic free kicks with David Beckham versus Greece. Here we go, David Beckham versus Greece. Ignore the fact that this is Finland because Greece aren't on the game anymore. David Beckham, we need it. Top bins. Boom. God, that was terrible. Come on, Bex. You got this, Bex. Boom. Oh my God. What a save. Oh, that's good power. Please go top bins. No, what a save! Boom! Oh, let's go! And if you thought that goal was iconic, the next goal in 2002 is Zidane's iconic Champions League volley. And our first attempt was pretty good, but not quite the Zidane volley. Oh! On Zidane's second attempt, he did this. Oh! That might be it. Can we get a replay on that one? Oh, it's still not top bins enough, but that was better than the first one. If his second attempt wasn't good enough, his third would be. That's it! That's the one! I am taking that! Left-footed volley. The play was perfect. It's not fully top bins, but the volley and the play to leading up to it was absolutely perfect. So I'm taking that. Moving on to 2003, Henri makes another appearance with another iconic goal during the Invincible season. So he gets played the ball about here, cuts in and just smashes it. Okay, that's attempt number one. This might not be as easy as I thought it was. Henri would be inches away on his second attempt. Plays it to Henri, cuts in, shoots. Oh my God, that would have been it. But he wouldn't miss his third. The pass to Henri. He takes it, he shoots. He scores. Let's go. Moving on to 2004, we have Zlatan Ibrahimovic's solo run for Ajax. This is one of the best solo goals in history. And our first attempt would be good. If only the AIs actually tried to intercept me and not back off. Ooh, that was a good attempt. But our second attempt was much better with Zlatan doing an outrageous skill run. We just couldn't score. Oh, oh my God. And on our third attempt, Zlatan did this. That's it! Let's go! I'm taking that! Oh my god, that was so good! From one icon to another, we have Ronaldinho's iconic 2005 Champions League goal against Chelsea. Plays it to Dino. Dino does a little skank and he shoots and it goes in! <laughs> that is pretty much exactly the goal. If you thought that was easy, the goals coming up are going to get so much harder, including this next goal from 2006, which is Maxi Rodriguez World Cup volley. This goal is so iconic because it was scored in extra time in a World Cup game against Mexico to win the game. And our first attempt was decent, considering Maxi is only 68 rated. Maxi, touch, boom! Oh, oh my god, that was a good second attempt. Our third attempt somehow went in, but we can't accept that. Maxi, this is it. This is it. No. Boom. Oh my god. 
As good as a goal that was, it wasn't the perfect recreation. Let me know how good you thought that one was. And for that reason, I've got my first fail point. And my first fail point is my first forfeit, which is a 2,800 FC point giveaway. All you have to do is comment below your favorite goal in this video and make sure you're subscribed and follow me over on my Instagram as that's where I'll be announcing the winners. Time to move on to the next goal which is 2007, where we have Messi's iconic solo run against Getafe. It's about here. Gets past one. Gets past two. Gets past two. Okay, I've been intercepted. That is attempt number one. And our second attempt would be much better with Messi coming super close to scoring. No! <laughs> but our third and fourth attempts would fail as we just couldn't get the ending right. We then had one last chance to get this goal. Oh, okay. He's got two of them gone. Oh, okay. That's three. No! no. <laughs> and that is our fifth attempt, which means our second fail point. Back-to-back -back fails. Thankfully, two fail points is nothing. But at three fail points, we have a huge forfeit. And we might get that with this next goal because 2008 was Ronaldo's famous free kick against Portsmouth. Bury it home, Ronaldo. Boom. Oh! That would have been so good. And on our second attempt, Ronaldo did this. Come on, Ronaldo. This is it. Boom. Oh! <laughs> I have absolutely taken that one. We've smashed it on two attempts. But if that goal from Ronaldo wasn't good enough, this next one will be, as 2009 was Ronaldo's famous long shot against Porto in the Champions League. Bruno Fernandes passes it to Ronaldo, who shoots. Oof. Ronaldo. Cassidy shoots! Oh my god, what a save! Ronaldo! Go on! Oh! Plays it to Ronaldo. Takes it! He shoots with it! Plays oh. it to Ronaldo. Takes it in his stride. Boom! Oh my god! Oh! Ronaldo attempt number five! Moving on to 2010, we have another super iconic World Cup goal. It's the Shabalala's goal versus Mexico. It's not just known mostly for the goal, but also the famous celebration. And as South Africa's not on the game, I'm going to have to transfer to Shabalala to Ghana. Don't blame me, blame EA. To Shabalala, the free ball's been played. He just has to score. To Shabalala, it's gone bottom bin. No. <laughs> To Shabalala, the through ball. Come on, please. Just top bins. Top bins. That's it. That's it. Now the celebration. The celebration. Let's go. <laughs> hey. If you thought that goal was easy, this next goal definitely isn't. One of the most iconic Premier League goals of all time. 2011 was Wayne Rooney's bicycle kick against Man City. And our first attempt was a great goal, but it's not what we needed. But on our second attempt, Wayne Rooney did this. Oh! <laughs> Taking it out. That was more of the Garnacho one because it was further out, but I'm absolutely taking that. Moving on to 2012, we have Sergio Aguero's Premier League winning goal. One of the most iconic commentaries of all time. Aguero! But this goal would prove hard to recreate as once again, it depended on the movement of the AI. And even though we scored two attempts, they were nothing alike the real thing until our last chance. Oh, I quite, oh my God, if that went in, that would have been it. But it didn't, which means another fail, another fail point and our next forfeit. And the next forfeit is another FC points giveaway, but this time it's doubled. I have to give away 5,600 FC points. So once again, make sure to comment below, subscribe and follow my Instagram to enter. With that said, it's time to move on to 2013, which bought us the famous Zlatan Ibrahimovic bicycle kick against England. This is probably one of the best goals we're going to see today. And I've got to recreate it. And on our first attempt, we scored this. Oh! Oh my god. Our second attempt was more promising, but there was simply no power. And this was the same for the third attempt. No power once again. Our fourth attempt would be our best yet. Zlatan! That was the best attempt we've done yet. 
blood and I can't get the power. We came so close. Literally almost perfected it, but I failed once again. And that means another fail is another fail point, which is one step closer to another forfeit. And that forfeit might come sooner than expected with this next goal in 2014. Van Persie's iconic flying header. He's made the run. Flying header. No. All right, he's making the run. He's made the run. Flying header. No! Oh my god, what a goal! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! That was like the perfect ball! Oh! He's just scored a flying header! But is absolutely not the goal recreated. And therefore, we can't accept it. Make the run, Vampy. Make the run, Vampy! Flying header! No, he's just scored another volley and we failed that's fail number five which means five fail points which means the next forfeit and it's the world's strongest smelling salts and to make it worse i bought a brand new one so it's even stronger three two one <laughs> i can't keep doing this i'm probably destroying my nose Woo! Now that I've got all that energy, let's get into this next goal, which is 2015. And it is the Florenzi long shot against Barcelona in the Champions League. This is one of the best Champions League goals you'll ever see. And we've got to try and recreate it. Florenzi gets the ball, runs down the side of the semicircle and shoots. How am I? Oh my God. We've hit the crossbar on our first attempt. Florenzi. Oh. Oh, I missed! Florenzi gets the ball. He shoots. Testegan's out. I missed again. But on our next attempt, we corrected our mistakes and got the goal. Florenzi! That's it! Let's go! Let's go! I think that was it. Listen, the height might have not been exactly the same, but the goal was pretty much identical. I'm taking it. The position was right. The keeper was out. And you know what? It's a great goal. Moving on to the next goal, which is 2016. Let's find out what goal is going to be. The famous Deli Alley volley. Can we recreate it? Let's find out. Deli Alley is on the edge. Touches it once. Touches it twice. Buries it. Bomb bins. Oh. Our second attempt was a great goal, but it's not the Deli Alley goal. Our third attempt, however, was much better, but it was the wrong direction. Boom! Oh, that was a good goal, Delhi. And our fourth attempt was the best one yet. But once again, it was the wrong direction. Oh, <laughs> I've recreated it, but I've done it the wrong way round. And if I do that again, I'm going to get another fail point. What means? Oh, why are you saving it? It's another fail point, which moves me on to six fail points in total. If I get one more fail point, that means I'm going to have to do another forfeit, which is at seven fail points. And I don't want to do this one. With that said, let's move on to 2017, which was Messi's iconic goal in the El Clasico against Real Madrid, where he took off his shirt and held it up to the camera. That marked his 500th goal and is one of the most iconic celebrations to this day. And our first attempt was a decent try. Messi! Oh my god. Our second attempt, Messi was nowhere to be seen. But he was back with a great effort on his third attempt. Messi! Oh, that was a better attempt. No, why is it not locking onto Messi there? <laughs> but on our last attempt, Messi did this. Messi! Messi! Let's go! That's it! That's the one! That's it. Look, he comes in, edge of the box. Slots it in bottom bins finesse from one goat to another 2018 was Ronaldo's famous Champions League bicycle kick and we would come close on our first try Oh, that would have been it Bellingham then showed Ronaldo how it's done. That's where you need to be Ronaldo We would come super close on both our third and fourth attempts and then finally on the fifth attempt Ronaldo scored it's a nice bicycle kick, to be to be honest. It's a bit too close, but I honestly might take that. That's not bad. 2019 would reintroduce the other go, Anker Messi, with a sublime free kick against Liverpool in the Champions League. And it's fair to say, our first attempt sucked. But we were getting closer. Oh my god! That was basically it. And closer. It's a lot of power. Oh my god, no way! That was perfect! And finally, please, 
Please, let's go! That's it! Come on! It's actually further back from where Messi took it originally, so I'm 100% taking that. Let's move on to 2020. And an iconic goal from 2020 is, you guessed it, Son's solo run, where he literally ran from his own half to the opposition's box and scored. Son. Off he goes. Off he goes. Human Son. Taps it through them. No, no! Oh, that would have been perfect. Our second attempt would get intercepted at the halfway line. Our third attempt would be our best yet, but we couldn't get past the last player. No! That's not fair! And on our fourth attempt, we finally scored, but it simply wasn't good enough. Son! You mean Son! I don't feel satisfied with that goal. I've got one more attempt. I'm not taking that one. I'm going for one more try. Son! Go on. Please go. Let's go. <laughs> that was good. That was definitely better than the previous one. I'm taking that. Let's move on to 2021. And the iconic goal from 2021 is Messi's goal versus PSG. This was one of Messi's last goals for Barcelona, which is why it's kind of iconic. And it's an absolute screamer. And on our first try, Messi did this. Oh, oh my God. That's first time. That's it. That is actually the goal recreated right there. That one may have been easy, but this next goal is extremely hard. Because 2022 brought us the outside of the foot wonder pass from Cancelo to Haaland. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Kovacic just nearly scored the Haaland goal. We would then score this on our third goal. I was undecided on it, so I'll leave it up to you guys to decide if it was good enough. Oh my god! The Trevella through ball from Cancelo was absolutely perfect. He scored the volley as well. I, I might have to take that. It's our second attempt. We then scored a bit of a better one, but once again, I didn't know if it was good enough. Oh, that might have been better. That might have been better. You guys can decide whether I deserve that goal or not. But with that said, we're moving on to the last goal. That leaves us with one more iconic goal, 2023. And you all guessed it, it is Garnacho's bicycle kick. This is probably the best goal I've seen in 2023. And I reckon it's going to be an iconic goal in the future. So, for that reason, we have to recreate it. Dallo crosses it about here. Boom! Oh, for our first attempt, that's not bad effort. Diego Dallo. Cuts it back. No! Just lock on to Garnacho there! Oh my god, that was it! Dallo runs down the line. Cuts it back. Garnacho! That's the wrong way. Plays it to Dallo. Dallo runs in. Dallo dinks it. Garnacho! Oh, that's the wrong side again. Dallo. Garnacho! <laughs> that's it. Dallo to Garnacho and he's put it top bins. I think I'm going to take that. You guys let me know if I deserve that last goal. If not, I will do another forfeit and it'll be in the next video. So let me know, do I get the goal or do I get another fail point and another forfeit? And if you like this video, then you'll like this one too. So go and watch it.